We've had a lot of great development in Hastings over the last year and I'm here to recap some of the information and share some of the projects with you. Hi, my name is John Hinsman. I'm the Community Development Director for the City of Hastings. And right now we're standing in front of one of those projects, which is Current 33. Current 33 is two apartment projects, uh, one that's 107 units, one that's 104. Uh, the unit you see right here, or the building, it just was constructed within the last year, open for lease as we speak. The other building behind it is 104 units. That's under construction right now and should be available for lease later on this year. When you look at the apartments that we've had and the building that we've seen in the last year, we had 206 new building units constructed within the city. We've also had another apartment project that is under construction right now. That is the Lake Isabel Flats within downtown Hastings. That's an 89 unit project and that'll be under construction and completed by April of this year. Also, we have a senior housing building under construction as we speak. It's being done as a modular construction, which means the building itself is being constructed off-site with components being brought on-site and erected. And that's under construction right now on County Road 47 near Riverwood Drive. That's expected to open up later on this year as well. That'll provide 75 units of both dependent living, senior care, and memory care. We also have single family housing that is going on as well. The Heritage Ridge development west of General Sieben Drive continues to move strong with 117 units, eventually new homes in that area, about uh, a third of the way built out right now. So lots of more opportunity within that area. Looking at other opportunities, we also have the Pleasant Ridge townhomes, which are under construction near Pleasant and North Ridge Drive. That is a project of 32 units of detached villa homes about half of those constructed right now, so more opportunities for folks to move in there. When we take a look at what we have accomplished over the last couple of years, a new KFC has been constructed over on Vermilion Street. The Confluence, which is a long-term project to rehabilitate the old former Hudson Manufacturing Building along the riverfront, is now open for business. It consists of a hotel, apartments, and restaurant facility and a wonderful backyard area that'll take advantage of the riverfront. So we're really looking forward to that impact as we move forward coming into the years. Also on the horizon for us, we're looking at another housing development on the south end of town. This one's called Walden. It would be 450 units altogether that would be a consisting of both single family, town home, twin home, and senior development in a combination. Uh, it would be a, a development that would be available for people of all ages. And that one right now went through the environmental review process and is about to go through the entitlement process, going to planning commission and city council as we move in through the spring and summer. So that'll provide for more capacity as we move forward here within the city. So we've got a lot of great projects that have gone on, a lot of great things to look forward to in the future. If you have any questions, more information is available on our website at HastingsMN.gov or give me a call at City Hall. Thank you.